<sighs> All right, this is my rant, my DC Universe rant. I don't get this. I I don't understand this. I'm in BD. This is the simplest raid of all time. BD, right? We're on the second boss. I'm in a group. I'm with a group. Me and my tank buddy are in here, and we're just like, okay, let's see if people can understand the book. They don't, right? You know, I understand. And the issue is they're all 163s except for about two people. They're like 140s, so I would give them a pass. But they're in instance chat. So I say, guys, this is what's happening. This is what's making you die. Please avoid this. If somebody dies next to the book, don't go res them because you will die. And you know what happens? You, you know... <laughs> <laughs> you know what bothers me? You tell you tell the guy, you say, this is what kills you. He says okay. I don't get it. He says he says okay. <clears throat> right? He says okay. And you tell him if somebody dies, do not I do not go res them by the book. Please don't do it. Please don't. You know what happens? Someone dies. And I tell him on instance chat, this person is, is going to die because he's not moving from the book. So, the guy dies, of course, because, you know, that's what happens when you stand next to the book. So, he dies. And then, some idiot that's not paying attention or in our instance chat voice set goes to resume and he dies. Of course, I told him, Jay, this is, you see what's happening? This is what's happening. So, Jay, the guy I just told, I just told him, I said, please, when somebody dies near to the, next to the book, don't go rest them. Please don't. He says, okay. As soon as the, inst the boss fight starts, the book pops up. This dude, after those two people died, he went to go res them, and he died. And my tank friend just lost it. He left. He said he can't do it. This was the third wipe, and it's the same issue. People are dying next to the book. The people are going to die are going to res them near the book, and you tell them this is what's happening. Please don't, you know, please don't, don't res this person because they're, they're as good as dead, right? You tell these people this, they say I understand, but yet they still die from the same issue. I don't understand this. You tell some, it's like saying, you tell somebody, uh, press one, two, three, okay? When you press one, two, three, all at the same time, just go one, two, three, a power is going to happen, right? That's a crazy power that does like 300 million damage, right? Now, if you press 1, 2, 3, 4, when you hit 4, you're going to die. Okay? So, don't press 4. Okay? You tell them, don't press 4. They go 1, 2, 3. You see the 1, 2, 3, then they press 4. Why? Is it because they forgot? Is it because... I, I don't know. Is it because they forgot? That, uh... That I told them, don't go next to the book? I mean, I, it literally was 30 seconds ago. I said, don't go next to the book. Don't rest somebody who dies on the book. He says, okay, it's that simple. And he still dies. I, I think that's the issue with the DC Universe community. Especially the, the guys who just skip content. You skip content. You're 163. I'm 162 right now. They're 163. And I'm just like, how don't you understand the lower tier raids? Like BN for God's sakes, PZ for God's sakes, BD for God's sakes, UM for God's sakes. Like, do you just like spam the rate the duos and wait for a new episode and wait for somebody to carry you to the next tier? Do you like skip the raid because you don't? I I don't understand what's going on. Like, people aren't learning the mechanics of a raid. And this is simple. You were telling them this is what's happening and this is what's causing you to die. And yet, they still do the same thing. It's like HH. HH was a huge example. 
don't attack on the skull. Please. Okay? Don't attack on the skull. First boss. They attack on the skull. I mean, some powers can help it. You know, you're stuck in animation or whatnot. Some powers you can block through. But, you'll tell them. You'll tell, like, a troller. It will be the troller. The troller. Don't attack the boss on the when he has a skull up. The the controller will be using freaking brawling powers, right? And then once the skull comes up, he'll still be hidden. And I'll just be watching. I'll be like, so is this guy going to die? And lo and behold, he dies. You tell people this is what causes you to die. They, under, they, they tell you, okay. And yet they still die because I don't understand. I really don't understand. They die because uh, I think it's stupidity. It has to be stupidity. Maybe they're freaking ten years old. I have no. I have no words. Someone tells you, "Don't do this. You will die." They still do it. What's going on? And then you have one CR one sixty threes dying by the books. I don't understand. I really, truly personally do not understand this and it pisses me it actually doesn't piss me off you want to know why because i'm in raids like this i'm i'm having an, i'm enjoying my time i'm having a sweet old time it's it's actually funny to see these people die because you know they're actually going to die and they're doing the same thing you know they're going to die you just know just by watching just cause i'm a healer i'm the healer so I'm watching these people die because they're standing and stuff they shouldn't be standing in. Literally, I was running the BN with somebody a couple hours ago. And <clears throat> this guy, he, he decided to go healer. I don't know why. But he went to healer with me. So I said, okay, let me go healer. So he goes healer. So Necron points at him. I said, when Necron points at you, you're gonna get uh, what is it? One of two things. You're gonna get or one of three things. You're gonna get the black hole and the invisible black hole that follows you, right? So this guy gets pointed at, and he says, "Okay, I'm pointed at." So I tell him, "There's an invisible hole coming at you. You might want to move." Because I'm telling them, I'm spamming heals to keep you alive right now. Because you're the only one that's like losing health like a lot. So I say, I'm literally spamming my heals to keep you alive from dying. He's like, okay. He literally types in the chat box, L. And I was like, I don't know what the hell that means. But I'm telling him, you're going to die. Okay? Do you understand that? He says, yes. I said, so you need to move. He said, okay. He stands in the same spot. And I said, you know what? In three seconds, I'm going to stop healing you. And in three seconds, if you don't move, you're going to die. It's as simple as that. So, I stop healing. He's a healer. And he's like 150-something. So, he goes from 80%. Then he heals himself back up. Then he goes to 60%. Heals himself back up a little bit. Then he goes down to like 20%. Then he heals himself up to like 40%. And he goes back down to 5%. And he tries to heal himself back. And he just dies. And the whole group's laughing. And I'm just like, this is what I don't understand. You're telling somebody, this is what... And during the raid, you're telling them to move. And they don't move. I don't... It, is it a connect... Is my connection, my mic... You're, are you receiving my, my info late? Is that what it is? I don't know. But I told him to move. I'm going to stop healing him. And he just dies because... He's standing in the spot. <sighs> God have mercy on DC Universe, man. I swear. My rant is over.